So the other day I was filming some video with my camera and uh, after I imported the files to my computer I realized that the previews, the preview thumbnails weren't visible as you can see here on these AVI files uh, and that's kind of frustrating because the, old, the only name the camera gives is this DSCF and then a number right? so it's kind of difficult to determine what's well, actually in the files. So I did some research online and I found out that uh, with a little registry hack or registry edit you can fix this for any file or well any video file as I as I found out. So if you open up your registry like this and you go to hkey classes root like so and search for AVI AVI right here and uh, you'll, I, uh, there's something missing here. I noticed that there's there's something missing. And uh, like uh, if you go down to the MP4 section, MP4. I had this open. Where is that? MP4. Uh, right here. Uh, this shell extension folder is important. It has these values and then this key in there. And that allows or that tells the computer how to create a thumbnail for mp4 files using Windows Media Player. And so mp4 files are fine, they, 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 the thumbnails are, are visible and you can see it, it's all fine with that. So what I did is uh, you right click on this and you click export and you save that, the uh, export, and what you end up with is this. I'll edit with notepad, slide it over here like this, you end up with these, this coding here for a uh, registry file. Now the trick here is to take these mp4 texts and change it to AVI. So AVI, tab down to the next one, AVI, and finally the last one, AVI, yeah. and then save it. Save it, all right? And so now that it's saved, you can close this and then run it run the program. So it says, do you want to uh, allow this? So sure, I'll allow it. And that's over here. Uh, adding information, it can be a problem, but I trust this because I've edited it and it should work. So I'll hit uh, yes. And okay. And it says it's been successfully added. Click that. Click okay. All right. And now that it's added, I'll go up to the AVI section. Again, I seem to have lost it. Uh, AVI, right, right there, there, and you'll see that this shell extension folder is added. Now, in the register, you can't just copy and paste; otherwise, I would have just copied this from the MP4 file or folder and just pasted it in here. But you, you can't do that. See, it's just export and a copy key name. Maybe that would have worked, but this way, with the MP4 file, uh, it's permanent, and you can edit it for anything like. Uh, Maybe MKVs, which I had problems with, which wouldn't, which weren't preview. So I did the same thing, renamed uh, this AVI to MKV, and did it, and it worked fine. All right. Uh, so now we'll go back to here, and the the thumbnails haven't been generated yet. So I've hit F5. F5. Okay, maybe I have to close the registry first. Oh, what's going on here? These are AVI files. Right, you know, I'll just close that. That was the folder. Yeah. Okay, and there we are. There we go. It just took a second. So that fixed it. Fixed the problem. It's uh, Windows 7 64-bit had this difficulty. I think it might have been VLC or something screwed it up. So uh, yeah, that's how you fix the thumbnail previews from uh, from being gone. So yep. Yeah. Alright, see ya.